Oh, I'm cooking. I guess that's three for take because it's going to be a twofer. But first off, I use this bowl because it's clear. It'll be more exciting. So I make some uh, mac and cheese, like the song says. But of course, I can't just have regular mac and cheese. This is how you make mac and cheese, extreme mac and cheese. So first off, I'm gonna take this. This is the, my favorite thing, the Trader Joe's Everyday Seasoning. Grind it up here. Everything's better. If you grind your spicy things, it's so much better than just like dumping them out of the thing. I don't know why, but that's not all. I'm taking ruffles because I got ridges. I'm taking a bunch. Crunching them up. Putting it on there. Now, mix that up. Mmm. That's good. That's really good. That's crazy good. And it's like so easy because I'm just using the Velveeta mac and cheese stuff. It couldn't be any easier. But wait, there's more. That's right, that's a pineapple. That's a big knife. And what is this? You don't even know yet. First thing you gotta do, cut off the bottom. Put it to the side. Then, hold up your magic thing. As a measuring tool. Cut off the top. Bad cut. Hold on. Ah. Now you're like, what are you gonna do now? A little crooked, but hey. This is so exciting. This is gonna blow your brains out. I'm almost there. That's it. <sighs> Makes perfect pineapple. And nothing's better than fresh pineapple. Mm -hmm. See you next week.